Hmm. Well, I like how as soon as I go to start this, there's a screaming in the background. I was at Walmart the other day, and they had the first eight Friday the 13th movies in a box set for 20 bucks, so I bought it. So I just watched the first one, and now I'm in the second one. Uh, and I'm just looking forward to watching the first eight Friday the 13th movies. But I'm going to have to stop them soon, because I'm leaving, because we're doing... CKTB, my radio station, is presenting this big hockey game. We're doing, like, a takeover, and most of my colleagues will be there. And we're doing, like, these games and stuff at this hockey game, so... That's where I'm going on this Saturday night. I know, me leaving the house on a Saturday night, bizarre. So I thought this might be a decent time to start a vlog, you know, while I'm leaving the house and going to hockey and that sort of thing. Very Canadian. I can't get over how good the Fenty foundation looks on my skin. As long as you really hydrate first, it looks really good. And these lashes are nice, too. I'm having a good makeup day. Check out Homeboy over here, just hanging out. You know, it's my box set. The first eight movies. I think I've seen the last, like, I know there's 12 movies. I think I've seen the last three in this because, like, there's, like, a random number of them that are on Netflix. Like, eight to eleven or something. But not the first couple. So we're watching those right now. An ice dog. An ice dog. An ice dog. I like your jacket. Thank you. I had to fold the collar of mine into my jacket because I was getting foundation all over it. I know, I had to wash the foundation off my jacket before I came. <laughs> These are the struggles, right? Just a mess. Hey, what's happening here? Did we play? Like, dude, yeah, you yeah. can't do it. He's doing very well. All right. 
He probably had that over at least like every day. So I bought a Kinder Egg the other day. If you're American and you're watching this, you don't have real Kinder Eggs there. Sorry, you just don't. Uh, it's another reason why Canada is great. Because Kinder Eggs. And they had like ones that were packaged in pink and had Belle on them. So I obviously got one of those ones. Oh, who doesn't want a Disney Princess Kinder Egg? And I gotta show you the toy. Gotta show you the toy. Look at this. It's like a little spinny thing of Rapunzel and Flynn Rider. And they come off, obviously. So then I thought I would look at the little, little sheet that came with it. They have one of each Disney couple, even Mulan and Li Shang. I want the Ariel one. I want, I want all of them, so I'm just going to buy a whole bunch of Kinder Eggs, I think. This is such a cute little collection. Look at them. And at last I see the light. Another Canadian tradition. Just rolled up the rim. Want a fucking donut. Look how Canadian I am. I saw hockey yesterday. Just opened a Kinder Egg. I rolled up the rim. Hey chubby monkey, you love the windstorm, don't you? Now for so Chris work uh, Narring by Devic and Hex is another five. I think I definitely forgot I think I definitely forgot another round of Hacks, but oh well. No, I don't care. This is round three. Yeah, yeah, we're, we've done all. Oh, yeah, because first round I didn't even get to attack it. Hello, and welcome back. So, my ad algorithm is finally starting to know me uh, at all, and apparently, you can order from Party City online. Did you know that? I didn't know that. So I just spent the last hour going through all 21 pages of their Halloween stuff. I'm going to show you the best of the best. Because I know you care so much about Halloween stuff in February. <laughs> this is what the Party City Halloween section of their website looks like. So I have all the tabs that I want to show you open up there. So this is a pack of stickers. Look at all the stickers. I just, I'm always a slug for Halloween stickers. Put them all over me, you know. Oh, these are the little surprise dudes. I have so many of them over here. Like, there's one of the twins from The Shining. There's, oh shit, I dropped him. There's Beetlejuice. I got Reagan from The Exorcist. I've got both Freddy and Jason back here somewhere. See, there's Jason. Where's Freddy? There he is. There's Freddy. So I want to collect them all, you know. So, I think the package that those ones came in also came with a Pennywise option. And that's why I kept buying these, because I wanted the Pennywise. But, so this isn't the same thing, but I would still buy this anyway, because Lydia's there. And then, I don't, I'm not totally sure who that's supposed to be. Like, he sort of looks like Spike from Buffy to me, but I'm not totally sure. And then I would assume that that's some sort of Hellraiser thing, that they can't make the pinheads, right? So, I don't know, it doesn't really tell me. Anyway, this fuzzy jack-o'-lantern clip that I love. Oh, these are kids tattoos. I really want to like create a full sleeve of jack-o'-lanterns on myself. Oh my god, I didn't even see this package. What? I went through the whole thing and I didn't even see these ones. <gasps> Yo. Oh, bish. I want these ones too. Not for children under four years. Guess what? I'm 25, and I can put these stickers on myself. Okay, these photo booth props, look at them. Trick or treat yourself. Hilarious, if you've got it, haunt it, handsome devil. Witch, please. Ghouls just want to have fun. Here for the booths. I just love it. This gothic mansion room wall. Imagine this is the background for my videos. Like, imagine. This big jack-o'-lantern ball. Wait, how big is it actually? Six and a quarter inch wide. That's not very big. Let me show you this one that I have on my Amazon wish list. Here it is, here it is. Look at this. Do you see this? This is a big pumpkin plushie. Look at how big it is. She's sitting on it there. Look at it. I want it so bad. I take these pictures to work all the time and I'm like, guys, should I buy these? And everyone says no, and I think I'm going to buy it anyway. But anyway, back to the actual Party City stuff. And not this $19 giant pumpkin that I want. 
Look at this little chandelier. Isn't that cute? I mean, it's six bucks and it's made out of paper, so it's probably terrible, but I thought it was cute and I just wanted to show you. These are so cute because I have those ones up there. So, like, what if I bought these and just replaced them? Huh? Uh huh, uh huh. And then I've only got two more. I've got this black, gold, and silver buffet decorating kit. So there's like cute little, I just, I like stationery and I thought these were cute. They're not really very Halloween-y, but I thought they were cute. And then look at this skeleton best costume trophy. It's an Oscar, but bones and he's holding his head and I just love it. Like I would buy this and like bring it to work and then like I'll award someone with the best costume. And I, I would pay the $6 and just like give it to them. Worth it. Anyway, thanks for coming to my February Halloween. Okay, so it's the next morning and I'm in Winners. I'm just hanging out and look what I see. The Blastoise Mega Constructs. But then I look slightly to the right. Charizard. And then I look slightly to the left. Ivysaur. I could make all three. Ivysaur is only $8, so I definitely feel like that should happen. I still haven't made a little island that comes with Blastoise, but... And then I can bring Blastoise to work and put them all together. That's amazing! Do I want Charizard? I found these chips. They're looking for something, so I'm gonna buy those. The Chris Evans Barbie doesn't look so bad, but they have a Chris Pratt one up here, and I'm curious. I wanna see it. Oh, nope, it's just dinosaurs, actually. I thought he'd be in there, too, but not. Not, not, not. My god, War Turtle. You like that moment when you feel a mascara flake fall into your eye, and you're like, well, my eye is now fucked for the next month of my life. I felt that happen, and I took my makeup off right away, but it still wasn't enough. Like, my eye is still red now and irritated. Okay, great. This video is going up so much sooner than I wanted it to. Like, I just wanted to keep my camera here and just keep vlogging for, like, weeks on end and just see what footage I ended up with. But today is February 28th, and my Guess of Gas bag did not come within the month. Uh, so... I had to edit this video to get it up in time so that I don't miss a Friday upload. But I'm frustrated because, like, I checked the tracking for the first time ever, and, like, it's just sitting at the distribution facility. Like, someone just needs to get it and bring it here from there. Like, it's just there. As soon as my Yes or Yes bag gets here, I'll do a video on it. Because I'm looking forward to the palette that's in it, actually. It looks cute, and I can't wait to try it, but I just need it to get here before I can try it. So anyway, thank you for watching this hodgepodge mishmash of a vlog. Make sure you give it your thumbs up. You subscribe to my channel if you have not subscribed already, you know, support your girl and her content over here in the land. Again, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.